Hi there, Ari Cross with Avian Horsemanship, and it is so windy outside today and really cold. I'm going to do my best to do a little video in the tack room showing the Tudor, some different angles of it. Um, especially when buying a dressage saddle, there's so many variations, and you know, more of a forward flap, a straighter flap, um, the knee roll size, um, the block size, the block location, uh, the waist, the twist, everything. Um, so I thought it would be helpful to do a little video showing it from as many different angles as possible so that hopefully get a better idea before you buy one of what you'd be getting. So first of all, nice view of waist and twist. You're going to see my dog occasionally, my feet. So you'll see there's a nice twist on there, um, especially for a treeless saddle. As far as treat saddles go, maybe close to a medium twist. A pretty open seat for dressage saddle, not overly deep. And then show you alignment of Wonka, get out of there, bud, of the stirrup bar. Puts you in um, a nice biomechanically beneficial position for the rider. So this is actually with the block out. You'll see there's a little pocket in there. So this is actually with the block out. I'll put the block back in again for you to see. Some people actually like taking it out and just using the knee roll and find that that works really well for them. So the block is back in the knee roll. And you'll see that the pocket is actually pretty big. Um, so you can really adjust these forward or backward. This one's in kind of a, a medium forward position. Um, you can move it all the way forward another half inch or so, or actually back probably another half inch pretty easily. You can also go quite a bit lower if you'd like, or even a little bit higher than this one is. This one's kind of in a medium spot. So hopefully that gives you a good tour of the Tudor and the angles of it, uh, the twist there, the seat, the flat position. Um, this saddle rack is puts at a pretty balanced position. Some saddle racks will kind of rock it back, um, which makes it even harder to tell if the flap is um, more forward or straighter. I would say this is kind of a nice in-between between a forward dressage flap and a straighter dressage flap. Um, I, I found it really nice. I hope you find this helpful. Feel free to contact me with any questions.